It's the 21st of November, 2016. It's Monday. It's laser disc day today. I found out a few seconds ago, Alfred Hitchcock. Foreign correspondent, a two hour Hitchcock. Oh boy. But uh, Hitchcock in his prime back when he was in England before he got all Hollywoodized. So nursing a bad back today because I moved a piano yesterday. Smart. Let's go, Alfred. Wow, <laughs> yeah, that's good Hitchcock. Uh, as the credits slowly roll to uh, America, land of the free, obviously a propaganda film of some sorts because it was filmed in 1940 when England was at war. Uh, good film, uh, I mean, not a great film. This particular uh, version kind of suffers like most of them do for, with not a great soundtrack. Uh, most of the early English uh, film, the sound was not that good. Print was okay. But I've never seen the movie before. It's entertaining. Uh, but what you get a sense of is this is Hitchcock as he's maturing. And uh, he, this is where he goes for the grandiose uh, scene. The, these huge scenes that are just like, you know, Mount Rushmore and North by Northwest or those kind of scenes where it's like one big almost cliffhanger to the next. And they're really lavish. And for their time, they're very well shot uh, considering what they could do with film. So, uh, you know, this is like where you get Indiana Jones. This is where you get all these pot boilers like Star, Star Wars. Uh, you know, it's, it starts here when they go from, you know, the, the stage and drama to life is a grandiose thing. And there's vistas like the Grand Canyon and there's jumping off, you know, uh, great big buildings. So interesting, interesting historical film today.